Microbiologists study microorganisms such as bacteria, viruses, algae, fungi, and parasites. In this video, we will go over what microbiologists do, the job market for microbiologists, what kind of money they make, and at the end of the video, we will cover the top five highest paying metro areas for microbiologists. Coming up. Hey everyone, Stephen Hack here with Career Watch, where we help you with your career search. We have weekly videos on job statistics, salary statistics, and other general career information. And if you enjoy this video, hit that thumbs up to support this channel. Microbiologists try and understand how viruses, algae, fungi, and other microorganisms live, grow, and interact with their environment. Many microbiologists work in research and development conducting basic or applied research. This could involve growing strains of bacteria and testing them in different conditions. Other microbiologists try to apply this research and development to products and services. Microbiologists have aided in developing new vaccines, creating new genetically engineered crops, and engineering better biofuels. There are quite a few types of microbiologists. Bacteriologists study the growth, development, and properties of bacteria. Mycologists study the properties of different kinds of fungi. Parasitologists study different kinds of parasites. And there are quite a few more different kinds of microbiologists. To become a microbiologist, you first need a bachelor's degree from an accredited university. To climb the ladder and eventually run your own lab, you would typically need a PhD. Microbiologists work for mainly a couple of different kinds of employers. 24% work in research and development, 15% work in medicine manufacturing and maybe creating new vaccines and other different kinds of products, 14% work in higher education, basically universities and colleges, 11% work in the federal government, and about 7% work for state governments around the country. As for the pay differences between these different kinds of employers, here's the breakdown for base salaries. The federal government on average pays microbiologists the most when it comes to base salaries with an average wage of around 107,000 per year. Research and development is next with an average base salary of around 101, manufacturing about 68,000. State government on average pays microbiologists around 58,000 per year and higher education pays on average the least with the average wage of around 57,000 per year. This next chart shows the national job market over the years for microbiologists. As you can see, the total number of employed microbiologists has risen and fallen over the years. In 1999, there were 15,630 employed microbiologists. During this time period, job growth didn't really start for microbiologists until 2008. The total number of microbiologists hit a high of 21,870 jobs in 2017. But recently, the number of employed microbiologists has been falling. In 2019, the government recorded 18,270 employed microbiologists. So from 1999 to 2019, the number of employed microbiologists has risen by about 3,000 jobs. The biggest reason to be bullish on the future job market of microbiologists is the novel coronavirus. Governments around the world are throwing lots of money at finding a vaccine for the coronavirus. And this experience of going through a pandemic will most likely lead to a greater job growth of microbiologists going into the future. Microbiologists will also be needed to develop new kinds of biofuels, create new kinds of crops, and help the world deal with new diseases. Next, let's take a look at what microbiologists have been earning nationally. In 1909, the average base salary for a microbiologist was $50,690. By the year 2019, the average base salary had risen to $82,760. So wages rose for microbiologists by $30,070 from 1999 to 2019. Here's how the pay breaks down in 2019. The starting salary of microbiologists would be a little under 43,000, which is the 10th percentile, and up to around 55,000, which is the 25th percentile. And how much do the top 10% of microbiologists earn? The top 10% of microbiologists start at around 133,000 per year and go up from there. Next, let's take a look at the highest paying metro areas for microbiologists. The average national wage is around 83,000 per year, but there are local regional wages that are much greater than this. So let's take a look. Number five on the list is the City of Angels. It is Los Angeles, California, located on the west coast of the United States. But microbiologists on average earn 90,400 in LA. Number four on my list is Atlanta, Georgia, also known as the city in a forest. In Atlanta, Georgia, the average microbiologist earns $95,590 per year. Number three on the list is the most expensive city in the country. It is San Francisco, California. 
where the average microbiologist earns $104,580. Number two is the nation's capital. It is Washington, D.C. The average microbiologist in Washington, D.C. earns $112,670. And this pr is probably because there are so many federal jobs in Washington, D.C. And this, again, is the highest paying employer for microbiologists. And number one on the list is also a really expensive place to live. It is San Jose, California, where the average wage for microbiologists is $112,670. Those are some high paying metro areas for microbiologists in 2019. Are you interested in becoming a microbiologist? Let me know in the comments below. Have a great day and I will see you next time.